Here's the first part of our video series introducing the so-called professional functions of MRP Easy. The matrix POM feature was originally designed for garment manufacturers, but can also be used for other types of production that have different component or product families. With the matrix POM functionality, it is possible to enter one article and change its parameters, for example, color, size, or material. Here's a demonstration of how the production process of a dress that comes in three different colors, three different sizes, and three different fabrics would be handled with MRP Easy. Before the matrix POM feature can be used, we have to make sure that under settings, system settings, and professional functions, matrix POM is set to yes. and the user is allowed to work with parameters and relations. We will start by creating three parameters, size, color, and fabric for the final product, the dress, and setting their values. We will also let the system know if any of the parameters affect the quantity of the material. In our case, size would be the only one that does that. Next, we will create stock articles for the three raw materials, cotton, linen, and silk, and add to each of them one parameter, color. and we can speed up the process by duplicating the articles. Then we will create a new relation. This is meant for the bill of materials in order to let the system know which materials are used for each combination. The combinations are made from parameters that do not change the quantity of the raw material. In our case, there are two of those, color and fabric. 
This is also what we use to name the relation, that is, color, fabric. And since there are two of those, we will set two as the number of parameters. We will then create the possible combinations. Finally, we will create the stock article for the end product, the dress. In the case of the dress, the number of parameters is three. Size, color, in fabric. We will then enter all the possible variations. If in our case variations existed for each combination, there would be 3 times 3 times 3 or 27 possible variations. Next, we will create the bill of materials for the dress. Instead of choosing materials, as is usually the case, we will choose the color fabric relation and enter the quantities according to sizes. If we are now to create a purchase order for a particular material, we can choose the necessary combination. Also, when we wish to make a new manufacturing order for the dress with certain parameters, 
the necessary combination can also be selected in a similar fashion. Thanks for watching.